on the hour hand in my clock. And the minute hands and second hands are the people who have helped me reach where I am right now. The coaches and teachers who have made each turn of my clock sharper and stronger. No matter what the future holds, we just have to keep moving and face whatever comes our way. This ability is in each and every one of us. Unlock it and use it and keep kicking. My name is Simsi Pahiolo. I am 11 years old and I am from Turkey, Istanbul. Paul Colin, I'm 14 years old. I live in Saint Barthélemy, in the Antilles. My name is Agassi Tomega. I come from Ghana and I'm 18 years old. My dad really likes tennis and his favorite player is Agassi, so he named me Agassi. Obviously, I used to watch like Grand Slams and tennis matches and with my dad and it was so fun because like he, we used to analyze the matches together and then I tried to do the same on the tennis court. And then that's how tennis really started for me. You know, it's been my passion since my dad introduced me to tennis. Je suis pensionnaire à l'Académie Moratoglou depuis deux ans. Je me suis fait beaucoup d'amis ici. Les gens sont sympas. Il y avait un club de tennis en bas de chez moi. Tous les jours, bah, je passais devant et euh, au bout d'un moment, j'ai demandé à mon père si on pouvait s'arrêter et on pouvait me prendre qu'à l'âge de 4 ans et pas avant. Du coup, bah, j'ai commencé à 4 ans. So I started tennis when I was six and a half years old. I started it mainly because my brother was playing it before. He started one year before me, and my dad thought that it would be good for us both to start it, and he thought it was a good sport for us to do. Here, I was surprised because they were all over the world. We have more than 35 countries here. That's a very mixture of culture. I have many friends from uh, Russia, Africa, America, England, Japan, and Mexico. And it's really good because you get to know about other people's like, culture and how they live. So it's quite like cool to learn about them. For the kids to grow in such a, a, a different place with different countries, with different kids, you feel like they grow faster here. And in the beginning, time management was kind of hard because it was sometimes the breaks were too short, but and then I got used to it and it was just a part of my daily uh, like routine. Par exemple, là je suis blessé au poignet donc un coach fitness, il a envoyé un message au kiné pour avoir un rendez-vous. Le médecin a transmis à mon coach comme quoi j'étais blessé donc euh, ils envoient directement un mail aux parents. Il y a une bonne communication au sein de l'académie. When you are on the court as a coach, make sure he comes on the court every morning with the 100% motivation. After the impact point, I want maximum acceleration. Ali, come on. Good night, Good night. Immediately after your shot, you turn. Again. Come on. Come in, come in. Boom. Set up and hit. Very good. My name is Patrick Muratoglu. I'm the founder of Muratoglu Tennis Academy. Originally, I'm a tennis coach and I've been working with Serena Williams for the last six years. I always loved players, I always, always respected players, and I always wanted to help them uh, achieve their full potential. Everything that was existing, basically, in, everywhere in the world, all the different places were proposing a system and the players had to fit into the system. And I thought it completely differently. I thought, let's create a system that is able to adapt to the needs of the players. And we made incredible results. And, uh, and I thought, wow, I, I found something that works. And we still have the same idea about whatever we do, whether it's uh, uh, tennis and school or the camps, it's the same. We have the goal to do something that will, is going to make a difference in people's game. And for that, we need to understand what we should add to each player individually.
the number one point of this academy being special is how we consider each player. When you know your player well as a coach and you are creative, you always find a way to attract his attention. Sylvia, she gives me motivation and she knows what I have to work on. You start slow, you accelerate second part. She knows me very well and I know her, so it's like a connection between us. Use that to make them give 100% on the court. Always find new tools. Good, I guess you're good. New situation. Go, 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 go. Good job. Good defense. And an intensity that is always higher and higher and higher. Play 100% in tennis. Go to fitness. Do your stretches. We do a lot of exercises together with the whole team. Guys, few advice. If you put your knee outside, you have strong step to push. Ready? Hop! C'est parti. Allez, on respire bien. Super. Come to the balance. Keep your head up. T'arrêtes pas. Allez, come on, come on. Ouais, bien ça. Ouais, Gassi. I think it's very important for an academy to be able to provide competitions all year long to keep the people and the players motivated. It's a very big part of the progress. Is there is no real progress in tennis without competition. Because what you've been working on at practice, to really get it deeply inside you, you have to be able to do it in matches. Don't rush, don't rush, you know it. Whenever you play on the back end, you get short balls, then you dictate the game. This place really helps my um it helps me improve my game because training without playing matches is not really improvement. Then you can have, you can train over here and play matches, and which is really helping me improve. Il faut avoir la bonne attitude, il faut se battre. Tant qu'il y a ça, le niveau de jeu, peu importe. C'est ce qui est important, c'est l'attitude. Not everyone is going to be a pro, and I want everyone to have the chances to succeed in life, whether it's in tennis. Even though they become professional tennis players, the career has to stop at some point. They have to be prepared for that life. We start school for 11 years old till 18. We have a French school, and then we have an international school in English. The program is actually made really good tennis and school mixed together. So there were base times that you had to be in class and on court and on, like, on warm up. When Sim arrived last year, I think there were six of them in class who had never been in a class of six. Now I improved a lot in two years, in like one year. I can play with many more people and there's always campus joining, which is good. She has done a brilliant job. Let's see how she develops in the six years, but she is on the right track. I always wanted the school to be as good as what we do on the tennis court. Wanted to find a good balance to, you know, have education and tennis at the same time. That's good, yeah, I guess you keep it up, huh? Outside of the ball and brush, good. We prepared him to be an adult now. Of course on the tennis court, but also at school. Every teacher is talking about integrity, you know, you have to be disciplined with your work. They have dreams, they have goals. So we prepare people, kids, to become successful in whatever they're gonna do in the future. So I got accepted into Florida Institute of Technology. I don't want to stop school at all, I really want to continue. And I want to have a scholarship in the US. So I understand that you would like to go to the US and um, get into a tennis team with a, with a scholarship, ideally. So um, in order to pick the right school and to guide you throughout the process, I'd like to know a little bit more about you. You choose the place because you, you, believe, you believe in the people, you trust the people. If it was for my son or my daughter, uh, I would do the same. I would go with the people that I think are the most trustful people, the most serious people. Uh, the most human people also because you want human people to take care of your kids. When I hear the parents talk to me and, and tell me about my place, and that's, they don't talk about the infrastructure, they talk about the people. And I think that the real value is there. Of course, it's a big day. Je suis tellement fier de tout ce qui s'est passé dans l'académie. It's the achievement of everything we've done for him. I couldn't do it without the help of the Academy.